Welcome, welcome. Take a seat, take a seat. Many, plenty of seats available. Um, if you do want to sit towards the middle, it'll be a little bit easier because I can see you and um, I will need to be able to see you so I can make sure if you get in or out. So, but I hope everyone had a good first day at the convention. Yes, no? Yes, okay, that's good, that's good. I was a little worried for a second there. <laughs> Oh, wow, a whole bunch of cosplayers. How are you guys doing? Are you, you guys might be a bit warm. I can see some very uh, thick, thick clothing. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. All right, so uh, make sure you grab a print. Uh, there's, they're free for everyone. It's got my details in the back as well as the rest of my group. So um, it's really cute, right? Yeah, so it's me. <laughs> It's me doing a magic trick. And then I also have uh, some really cute plushies of my friends and also some really cute Australian animals. <laughs> yes, as, as everyone's coming in, do make sure to kind of stay um, as close to the middle as you can so I can see you. Uh, Cause if you want to play the game, then I need to be able to see you so I can tell if you've gotten the answer right or wrong, okay? But if you just want to sit and chill, that's fine too. Mm -hmm. <sighs> While people are filing in, I think I'll introduce myself a little. Oh, I see a venti. Hi, venti. <laughs> uh, so I'm Jezebel Belladonna. I'm a magician's assistant uh, and I'm a VTuber and I stream on Twitch. Uh, and I play a lot of different games. I'm a variety streamer. So um, I have some other panels that are happening uh, tomorrow and on Sunday as well. So if you're free, do come to those. Uh, you can see the details of them on my Twitter and also in the guide for Anime Fest. Uh, you can also, if I'm not in a panel, uh, you can have a look at the Anime Fest merch table. And um, I have some merchandise there. And I'll actually also be hanging out there too. So you can come talk to me if you're free. <laughs> and I do wonder how everyone's anime and gaming knowledge is. Do you, does everyone in the room think they can do pretty good? Because I picked some hard questions as well as some easy ones. Hopefully, hopefully we can, uh, hopefully we can challenge you. <laughs> All right, I'm just going to grab a drink. Oh, uh, where's my mouse? There it is. Oh. Welcome, welcome, everyone. Come in, find a seat. Um, like I've been saying, if you want to if you wanna be able to be seen a little bit easier, you'll do want to sit more towards the middle if there's a free spot, uh, because I... Uh, You'll have to do hands on your head, hands on your hips so, to, to participate. Um, so it's a, yeah. oh, and if you do want to ask any questions, I, there should be a mic up the front. So if you've got any queries, I believe um, we can get, get that confirmed for you. Oh, or unless the mic has been moved. It's a little hard to tell from this spot. Ah, oh, okay, yes, yes. The mic is being pointed out. So if you have any questions before we start, um, in, raise your hand and then come over and then you can ask the question. But the question has to be in the microphone or I can't hear you. All right, all right. That looks like it's, that looks like it should be about everyone. Awesome, awesome. Okay, so like I was saying, I hope you guys have, uh, are ready because like I said, I picked some easier questions and some harder questions. So we'll go over the rules. The rules are, if you want to play, you have to stand up. Uh, and if you want to answer A, you put your hand on your head. If you want, sorry, you put your hands on your head. If you want to say answer B, you put your hands on your hip. If you out, you have you sit down. And um, there's there's three sets of prizes. So uh, I have some merch. So I have some really cute washi tape. So if you get third place, you'll get a washi tape. If you get second place, it'll be washi tape and then one of my really cute enamel pins of the playing cards that I use. Uh, I can actually show you a little bit what they look like. They are these ones right here so you'll get a pin a pin like that 
And then if you get first place, you'll get a washi tape, a pin, and then one of my keychains as well. So that's what you're playing for. And also, you know, bragging rights. That's always good. All right, is everyone ready? Oh, and sorry, one last thing. If, if we do have a question where everyone gets out on the, on the one question, we'll skip that and we'll keep going so that, so that I'm not, so you're not, everyone's getting out, okay? Sounds good? I can't hear you. Woo, okay. All right, everyone who wants to play, up. let's go, let's go, up, up, up. Yeah. Okay, so we're starting out with some easier questions. Oops, wrong button. Question number one. In the movie Your Name, what happens to the two main characters, Mitsuha and Taki? Do they change ages or do they swap bodies? For A, put your hands on your head. For B, put your hands on your hips. Looks like, is that everyone who's answered? Okay, anyone who has their hands on their head, you'll need to sit down. Looks like, oh, it looks like everyone, uh, most people seem to know that one. Good, good, good. All right, all right. Next question then. Are we ready? Pokemon. But we all know Pokemon, right? There's like the new games that came out. There's uh, like the anime. How well do you remember all the evolutions? Which, which of this group has a Pokemon that is not an Eevee evolution? <laughs> So if it's A, Leafeon, Lumion, Vaporeon, or Glaceon, or B, Umbreon, Flareon, Jolteon, Espeon. Oh, that's a lot of people with hands on their heads. All right, if you put your hands on your hips, you're out. But I, from looks of it, everyone's got that. Maybe I made some of these questions a little too easy. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Right. <laughs> that's okay. There are some harder ones. There are some harder ones. We'll get, we, we will get a winner. Who knows some Animal Crossing? Have you? Did you guys all play Animal Crossing? I know that the pandemic was uh, a, a good time for a lot of people to play it. I played it quite a bit, actually. Uh, I actually restarted when uh, the new DLC came out. So I've been playing that. In Animal Crossing, what do you traditionally have to give Tom Nook to pay off your home loan? Is it rupees or bells? Uh, let's see, let's see. I don't see anyone with their hands on their heads. If your hand is on your head, you're out. because. It is indeed bells, no pun intended, because my short the short version of my name is bell. <laughs> okay, a little bit of a trickier one, maybe. If you haven't seen the series, you might have to guess. Who are the characters from Bungo Stray Dogs based on? Are they famous authors or mythical heroes? Oh, okay, I can see a few people have seen Bungo or at least know of it. Good, good. My favorite character is actually Chuya, um, if you've seen him. Uh, but I like all the other characters. I see, I see someone bouncing in the front there. Do you like Chuya as well? Yeah. yeah, yeah, nice, nice. He's good, he's good. Are you looking, uh, has anyone seen? This is actually the poster for the, uh, the next season of the anime that's gonna be coming out hope, sometime next year. But yes, if you put your hand on A, uh, for, for, put your hands on your head for A, then you are correct. They're all based on famous authors and their abilities are based on famous on their famous books. It's quite a fun series actually. So if you like Sanin, you should give it a try. Mm -hmm. If you're out, don't forget, you do need to sit down, but I can see there's a couple of people that have sat down and we'll keep going. Okay, so question five, Promare. I know that Promare came out a few years ago, I don't know if everyone got to see it. I saw it, it was quite fun. Um, in Promare, Galo Thamos, Thamos doesn't wear what? Because that's something that he is, that's part of his character design. <laughs> is it A, a shirt or B, gloves? Oh, wow, okay. That was very quick. I just noticed that everyone put their hands on their heads. Okay, you are correct. If you put your hand on your head, it is definitely, he does not wear a shirt. I had to, <laughs> there's a couple of them where I had to look up pictures that were very specifically not including the character because it gave away the answers. So <laughs> this was one of them because all the posters have him on there and it's very clear that he's not wearing a shirt. Um, and yeah, <laughs> so I was like, okay, what can I do to find, like literally every single picture of him had no shirt. And I couldn't, there wasn't even like a headshot or anything. So, so <laughs> trying to find a good picture, very difficult. 
All right, looks like we've got still a fair few people. Good, good. Okay, another another quite popular series, Kimetsu no Yaiba or Demon Slayer. What are the colors of Tanjiro's Haori in Demon Slayer? Are they red and white or green and black? Let's see, let's see. Uh, okay, if you put your hands on your head, you are out because he has green and black. <laughs> okay. I think uh, from memory, uh, his sister has green, sorry, has red and white on her part of her belt. And that is, that's kind of where it was a little bit trickier, but I, it's pretty, it's a pretty iconic, iconic outfit, you know? Who here likes oh, fate? Let's go. <laughs> let's go. Yes, yes, good, good. <laughs> Very good. I put my best, my best boy on screen because I'm biased and I can. <laughs> my favorite is Ku. Uh, there are a lot of Fate series servant classes. Now, this one will be tricky if you haven't played FGO uh, or you haven't heard them all. Which of these two servant sets has the correct servant classes? We have A, which is Caster, Avenger, Reela, and Saber. And B is Archer, Moon Cancer, Berserker, Lancer. All right, has everyone, has everyone got their answers? Looks like it. If you said B... You are wrong. The answer is A. Oh, sorry, sorry. Which one says had the correct one? I'm sorry for everybody. <laughs> the other way around. My apologies, my apologies. I thought I said which one does not. Sorry, sorry. Up, up, up. <laughs> I misread my own question, forgive me. If you put your hands on your hips, you're correct. So, yeah, sorry. <laughs> yes, Moon Cancer is a more recent one. Sorry, my bad, my bad. <laughs> look, look, it's been a long day. I'm sure you can all understand. We've been busy buying things and going to panels and I can't read apparently. My bad. <laughs> I have actually, I have actually been a fate fan for a very long time. So this is a little bit embarrassing. <laughs> but this, this, this just stays between us, okay? Okay, shh, shh, shh. If this isn't being streamed on Twitch or anything. <laughs> shh, shh, shh. Okay. Uh, House of Moon Castle. In House of Moon Castle, what color is House hair at the end of the movie? Is it blue, black, or is it blonde? Because he has both throughout the movie, but what does he end up with at the very, very end? Okay. All right. If you put your hands on your head, you are correct. He had blue, black hair at the end of the movie. <laughs> um, I actually like his blonde hair more, but uh, I, I understand. I understand the, the the changes that went through. It was fun. That's a good. It's a good movie. If you haven't watched it, you should. I rewatched it recently, actually. Okay, who who here knows Sailor Moon? In Sailor Moon, Chibi Usa, who is Sailor Chibi Moon, is Usagi and Mamoru's what? Is she? The daughter or granddaughter to them? Yeah, yeah, looks like everyone's answered. Okay, okay, so the answer is daughter. So if you put your hands on your hips, oh, yeah, I can see a few people jumping and, and doing fist pumps. Good, good. Has anyone watched the new the newer series? Has, have you seen the movie yet? It was on Netflix for a little bit. Yes, no, no, yes. I see a few nods, a few, few head shakes. It was quite good, I enjoyed it. I've, I watched the original um, way back when it came out. Um, so it was fun seeing the differences and, and a little confusing because uh, there were some changes that were very different <laughs> as, as it that happens with remakes. Now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. I've asked a UVA question. I can hear, is that some groans I hear? Mm. 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 Okay, well, in Yu Gi Oh! Yu Gi Muto's ultimate ego, Yami Yu Gi, was what in his past life? Was he a priest or a pharaoh? Mm. Okay. I can see everyone's got their hands on their hips, which is good, because that's right, he's a pharaoh. Very good, very good. Okay. 
All right, don't worry. I put all the easy questions at the start. So it's gonna get it's gonna get more difficult as time goes on. All right, who here has played Persona 5? Who here knows the name of the cat in Persona 5 that tells you to go to sleep? I actually haven't played Persona 5, but even I know this from my friends who are very obsessed with the game. Um, so I'm very curious, is it A, Tanaki, or is it B, Morgana? And I see, okay, let's see. I could see one person with their hand on their head. Unfortunately, um, you are out. It is B, Morgana. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That one, that one, that one's a little bit hard because um, it's, if you haven't seen the series and you don't know about it, it can be very tricky because, yeah, the name's not super common. Now, I can see one person at least to hear who will know the answer to this question immediately because I, <laughs> yep, I can see you then too. I can see you. I can see you shaking your hands. And I can see everyone has immediately, immediately go de- gone to answer. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I understand. I understand. <laughs> okay. In that case, uh, I'll, I'll still read out the question anyway, but I think, I think most people already got the answer. What is the name of the companion to the traveler? Who, uh, that is in Genshin Impact. It is Paimon. You, everyone is correct. All right. All right. Mm-hmm. All right. I definitely picked some, I picked some really easy questions in some places, huh? All right. That's okay. That's okay. Hey, has, has anyone started to watch Call Me Can't Communicate? No. Oh, I heard some yells and some no's. Oh, interesting. Okay. It's actually very good. It's on Netflix at the moment. I quite enjoy it. Um, I really like the characters so far. Okay, so in Komi Can't Communicate, what is Komi's dream that she tells Tadano in the first episode? Is it A, to be able to speak in public? Or is it B, to make 100 friends? Okay, I'm looking. All right, I don't see any hands on head, so it looks like everyone's got that right. Hmm, okay, okay. I actually didn't know that until I started watching it. My friend had read the manga. Um, but yes, that's correct. To make 100 friends is, friends is her dream. Okay, going, going towards some older series. Um, let's, see, let's see if people can remember this one. What is the name of the cards that Sakura uses in the, at the start of Card Captor Sakura? Is it the Cloud cards or is it the Sakura cards? Let's see, let's see. I see a couple of people haven't decided yet. Trying to remember. Because both names do get used. It's just when do they get used is the question. All right. Uh, has everyone got A for Cloud Cards? Looks like it. Okay. If you put if you put soccer cards, she does use that, but not till later in the series. So the answer is A. All right. Sorry, I'm just grabbing a drink. It's very warm. Hmm. Hmm. You guys are getting these questions very quickly. All right. All right. Who here has played Gensh- uh, Genshin Impact? Grand Blue ah, Fantasy. <laughs> Grand Blue Impact. Who's played oh, Grand Blue? <laughs> sorry. Sorry. Who here has played Grand Blue Fantasy? Hmm. This one might be a little bit tougher. Or you may have, maybe you've played Grand Blue Versus, or maybe you've played, uh, or maybe you've watched the anime because it was an anime that came out as well. Which of these characters is not from the game Grand Blue Fantasy? Orionis or Luria? Luria. Let's see. There's a couple. Yep. Okay. Don't know if Randy is here, um, but I'm sure he's yelling <laughs> right about now. The answer is A. A Orionus is not from Grand Blue Fantasy. It looks like, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Good, 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 good. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. All right. Who's seen or played Dungan Rompa? I see a couple of people flailing and bouncing. <laughs> <laughs> I understand. I understand. I had to be very careful about the picture I picked for this because all the pictures that I looked at otherwise had all of the had the answer effectively. So, how many students are there in Dungan Rumpa Trigger Happy Havoc? So that's the first game, or you can use the first anime. It's 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 the same thing. So it's either A, which is twenty, or B is sixteen. I see a couple of people bouncing. 
Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. If you put your hands on your hips, you are correct. Well done. Well done. Let's see. How many people do we still have in? I can see. Let's see. There's a couple of people who are. I can't quite tell on the sides. So if you're if you're in this on the sides and you're still in, if you could shuffle in a little bit, um, I can't quite see everyone. I want to make sure that everyone gets a chance. Yeah, yeah, squish in a bit. That's good. That's good. Okay. Oh, <laughs> you don't have to jump up. You just have to go in a little bit. It's all good. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Who's seen this movie? Has anyone seen this? I hear a couple of voices. I see some like, bouncing and some waving. Okay. Uh, this is Lupin the Third, the first, which is not confusing at all. Um, this is actually a 3D anime, if you haven't seen it. It's really good. They did a really good job with the animation. I quite enjoyed this one. I actually got to see this while I was in Japan when it was airing. Um, so if you do get a chance, I do recommend it. In the, in the Lupin the Third, the first movie, what is the name of the power generator and weapon that's being searched for? Is it called the Eclipse or the Celestial? Uh, let's see. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. Yep. All right. Everyone, everyone's got, looks like everyone's got that. Or at least I, I think that's everyone. It's a little bit hard to see. Um, but yes, if you had A, A is the correct answer. Well done. Well done. Hmm. 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 <laughs> who knows who knows some vocaloid oh, no. <laughs> oh oh okay i can see venti's venti's going i saw a few other people bouncing which of these songs is not a hatsune miku song wild is mine or sets no, no eye looks like okay okay there's a couple of people changing their minds a couple of people thinking okay if you put b B is correct because Setsu no, no I is the is an opening song from uh, Bungo Stray Dogs. Actually, it's by Grand Rodeo. Hmm, hmm, hmm. So, well done, cool, cool. Got some very very good trivia people in here. I wonder, I wonder how people will go with my last question because that one was kind of an evil one. We're not there yet though, so we'll see. We'll see. What about an? <laughs> okay, what about some Final Fantasy? Um, not Final Fantasy Online because, uh, as you may have heard, the, uh, the the free trial is no longer available for some people. Uh, but this is for Advent Children, uh, the movie. <laughs> All right. In Final Fantasy VII, Advent Children, what are the names of the three main villains that were trying to resurrect Sephiroth? Are they Rufus, Genova, and Denzel? Or Kadaj, Loz, and Yazoo? So is it A or B? All right, looks like we've got a couple people. Interesting, interesting. It's actually quite mixed. So if you put A, you are incorrect. The answer is B. Ooh. Oh, that took out a few people. Who have we got left? Who have we got left? Oh, there's some more people coming in. Okay, uh, can you, sorry, it's a little bit difficult to see. Can you put your hand in the air if you're still in? Oh, there's three people. Okay. Oh, no, four people. Okay, interesting. All right. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Okay, can, 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 can everyone who's still in, can you move towards the middle so I can see you all nice and clear? What we might do is if, if we get to the answer it's only been half an hour if we get to the answer then i might do a couple of bonus ones and we'll see what we can do from there perhaps all right all right let's see oh oh, oh i hear some disgruntled sounds so in, so in my hero academia deku is a high school student but originally he was going to be something else what was he going to be in the prototype of the series was it a teacher or an ill salary man? Let's see. Oh, okay. Going. All right. Is that everyone? All right. The answer is B, actually. He was going to be a salary man. Wait, no. Sorry. Hold on. The two of you who just sat down. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a second. Because there's what? Four people left? We need a third place. So you two. Oh, there's five? Six. Oh, oh. 
Six, six. Okay, sorry. You have to. I can't see. I can't see past the person with the polka dot skirt. So if you are, if you're still in, please come into the middle so I can see you. Oh, awesome. Okay, cool. Oh, oh, oh. There's someone right in the middle. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. All right, that's okay. All right, because if we if we get to the point where there's only like two people left, then someone's gonna have to fight out for third place. You know? Okay. <laughs> Don't worry. I won't make you actually fight. Maybe. All right. Fruits Basket. Oh, hey, Please watch the remake of Fruits oh. Basket. I see some hands up. Did you guys like it? I really enjoyed it. I have to finish second oh, season. Oh, yep. Okay. How many Zodiac animals are there in Fruits Basket? People who turn into animals. So specifically people who turn into animals, not necessarily anything else in terms of like people who used to be able to that doesn't count uh okay looks like ah oh, you're changing it, your mind okay all right the answer is 13 yeah because you also have you have the 12 zodiacs and then you also have the cat which is yeah mm -hmm -hmm. all right so who've got left i'm just trying to see i can see there's a couple people. Three. There's three. Three? Okay. Oh. All right. Ooh. Okay. Well, we're getting down towards our last kind of question. So that's that's not too bad. All right. This will be interesting. Okay. So for third place, who has watched oh, Where the House yeah. Husband? Oh, okay. That was quick. Everyone answered that really quick. Uh, what did Tatsu used to be before he became a house husband? The answer is he, he was a Yakuza boss. Everyone got that and run really quick. All right, that's fair. That's fair. Uh, now, this is a more recent series. Has anyone seen the case study of Vanitas? Oh, I can see a hand up. Oh, I can see a second hand up coming up from the bottom of my screen. <laughs> nice, nice. Okay. What is the name of Noe? I can't pronounce his last name. Uh, Noe's cat in the case study of Vanitas. Is it A, Shiro, or B, Mer? Okay. All three of you got your hands on a hip? Okay. Yep, that's fine. That's fine. That is correct. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. I have two planned questions left, so this will be interesting. How much do we remember Monica? What are the names of the creatures that Monica and the other girls fight in Quella Magi Ma Magia Madoka Magica? Whoa, what's a mouthful? Is it wraiths or witches? Hmm. Okay. All right. So you've all got your hands on your hips. That's correct. This is a fun question. <laughs> what movie uh, beat uh, Avengers uh, Endgame in box office in, in the box office in Japan when it was number one in the rest of the world? Was it Detective Pikachu or was it Detective Conan, Fist of the Blue Sapphire? There's there's a couple hands up and get people might know in the crowd okay let's see let's see uh all right so we've got two with their hands on their hips and one with their hands on their head okay the answer is detective conan actually yes well done well done hmm. okay well oh mike is running over yes 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 so you've won third place so Mike is going to get that for you. So it's some really cute washi tape with gold foil. Congrats. Everyone, a round of applause, a round of applause. Hmm. That was actually a little faster than I had, had anticipated. So mm, time to do some on-the-fly que questions then. Let's see. Let's see. Mm -hmm -hmm. Let me have a drink while I think about... I'm actually, I'm, I'm very impressed because there was a lot of, there's a lot of very different trivia questions there. Hmm. Let's see, let's see. I had, I had some extra questions planned, but uh, my, my screen, my, my document for them actually crashed. So <laughs> I don't have them at the moment. So, uh, hmm, 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 hmm. I'm curious. I'm curious. Have you watched more older series or newer series? Let's see. 
because everyone, you guys answered the questions quite well. Hmm. How much do you know about the YouTubers, though? Is the question. <laughs> do you guys do you guys know anything about VTubers? Have you heard some things? No. no, some head shakes. Ah, were you in my panel earlier by chance? No, because I, I, I know you things. exist. <laughs> I do exist. Yes, thank you. Thank you for acknowledging my existence. I appreciate that. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Okay. That makes it tougher then, because I was going to try and do some um, VTuber type questions, but that's okay. Let's see. Mm -hmm -hmm. Have you guys watched Spirited Away? Or yes. 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 Okay. yes. Oh God, that, that's a resounding yes from the room. That's that's fair. Do you guys remember? what the main character's two names are. Yes. Yes, yes. Can 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 I get them in? Uh we'll do we'll do we'll do like a death match. So uh I I'm sorry I I, I the uh, in in red uh what what's your name? My name is Aaron. Aaron? Okay what are the what are, what what is the main character's name? Shahiro. Her real okay. name is Shahiro. Okay and what's her other name that's ben. given then okay mm -hmm. very good very good um uh i don't i don't know if anyone else could hear that but <laughs> goodness are you haunted <laughs> i i think i may have been haunted oh no oh dear oh dear um give me one second let me check Oh dear. Oh no. <laughs> I'm, I may have become haunted. This is terrible. They've locked me in the panel panels and, and then the bug cage and now I'm becoming haunted as well. Oh dear. <laughs> okay. All right. Goodness me. Uh, give me one second, everyone. This is good. Getting on it. <laughs> Okay, all right. <laughs> Enough excuses. No excuses here. Only, only, only fun anime times. Okay. Ignore the ghosts in the machine. We are getting. We're gonna. We're just gonna. <laughs> okay. I hear nothing. You hear nothing. Exactly. That is the correct response. Um. Uh, I'm sorry. Other other person with the polka dot skirt. May I ask your name as well? Celeste. Celeste. Oh, that's a lovely name. So it was Erin and Celeste, is that right? Mm -hmm. Okay, and what are your pronouns, may I ask? So I'm not using the wrong ones. She. And Erin? Uh, she. She as well? Okay, great, good. I just wanted to be sure because I don't want to, I don't want to use the wrong thing. All right. So Celeste. Uh hmm. Oh goodness. <laughs> uh have a <laughs> well i mean this makes it more exciting like <laughs> uh mm -hmm -hmm -hmm. okay have you watched any otome series uh so do you know of series like hakuoki no i don't no Mm, okay, interesting. Okay. Has anyone here heard of the series Hakuoki? Looking for a ray a hand? Uh is that one hand up there? Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay. Let's see. I will we'll do it, we'll do best of three. So you both get three get three questions each, and then whoever gets the most of the three questions correct will will, will win first place, okay? All right. Celeste, what uh, in in Hakuoki, What are the what are the what is the group that the main character Chizuru is working with to find her father? Is it the Shinsengumi? 
or is it Darasetsu? The latter. No. The latter, so Darasetsu? Yes. Uh, unfortunately, that is incorrect. So it's actually the Shinsengumi. Sorry, it's uh, at one zero at the moment. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. All right. Erin. Uh, hmm. A question now for you. Let's see. I have to pick something that you don't know. So it's more or le le no less. So it's even. A little bit more challenging. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, well, I wish I, I wish my, my question, my, my document hadn't crashed. <laughs> all, all my spare questions are gone. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Okay. So I'm going to ask a question about fire emblem. <laughs> I hear a few cheers in the crowd. That's good. All right. Mm -hmm. What is. Mm. Oh, okay. What is one of the houses? Uh, okay. Actually, let me give me, give me one second. Let me double check this answer because I haven't played this in a while. Da, 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 da. Okay. Apologies, apologies. Okay, so which, which of these houses, so there's three houses, there's the black eagles, the blue lions, or the golden deer. Which house is Dimitri from. Can you list them again? Sure. It is black eagles, blue lions, or golden deer. Is it blue lions? That's correct. Yes. Okay. So you're two. All right. So Celeste, you'll need to get this. You'll need to get this one correct. All right, <laughs> let's see. <laughs> What's some series you know, Celeste? Um, let's see. Hmm, because I did give an answer for a question that that was uh, that, that for a series you did know. So I, I did know, and then I did one you didn't know. So um, we'll do one that you that you do know now. I'll see what the end, see if I can come up with something tailored. Have you watched anything recently? Any movies? Uh, it could be one of the series I've already mentioned. Um, I've watched Bleach and I watched. Okay. Yeah. Sorry to put you on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so you've watched Bleach. Okay, it's been a while since I've watched Bleach, but hmm, 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 hmm. How well do you know Bleach is the question? I know. Okay. Uh, who, okay. So in Bleach, uh, what, what division is Rukia the captain of? Oh, the 13th division. Oh, very good. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Erin, your turn. If you get this correctly, you win first place. Hmm. So many choices. So many choices. Let's see. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. So you know I exist, which is nice. Um, do you know much about Grand Blue? Mm, no, I 
I think I've played a little bit, but I don't know much. Okay, you've played a little bit. Okay. Then I will ask you a Brian Blue question. Can you name one of the knights um, of the white dragons or the black dragons? No. No? I think I played like five minutes of it. So yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. That, that's fair. Do you know the names of the main characters? So the MC that you play as, do you know, either Not, of their names? Nope. Hmm. No. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. That's fair. That's fair. All right. Let me think. So you played the first five minutes. Well, you've definitely seen that. You'll definitely have seen it, but that's okay. Do you I'm know... not even totally. Sh- I'm not even totally sure I did that. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> that's fair. Okay, that's all right. Um. Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna ask you a question about one of the series that we've already asked. Then. Okay. Because I believe that will be a little bit easier. Let's see. Any, 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 You know what? We're going to do Bungo Stray Dogs question. All right, so this will be the... Oh, you, you do know Bungo? Yes. Okay. I'll have to pick my question carefully then. Uh. <laughs> uh, hmm. What is the name of the skill, so the ability that the head of the armed detective agency has. So Fukuzawa. Dazai or? No, so Dazai isn't the head. So um, Dazai is one of the agents, but the person that they all answer to. Oh. Um... All I can think is Dazai is no longer human. Uh, mm. So yeah. to, give you a, to give you a hint, his ability is what allows the other members of the ADA to control their abilities better. So it, it gives them, it basically gives them training wheels in a sense. I don't know, I'm sorry. Uh, that's okay, all right. So the answer is um, all men, uh, all men are created equal. Um, so that's his ability. And that means that he, uh, the others are allowed to control their powers better, which is what allows Atsushi to stop rampaging as the were tiger. Okay, so the, the answer, so it's currently two, oh gosh, I've, I've lost score. It's two all? Two, one. Two, one, two, one. Okay, so Celeste. Meeny, 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 meeny. All right, I'm going to pick another series. <laughs> what is the, the name of the f- second friend that Komi makes in Komi Can't Communicate? I do not know. Do not know? Okay. It's um so if you have a look, if, if you can see the the purple hair color character, that's them there. They're called Najimi. Najima? Najima. Sorry. They used Najimi at one point. So okay, so in that case, then that means um Celeste, you got second place. So you win an enamel pin and a washi tape. And Erin, you got first place. So you get those and you get Ooh. one of my really cute keychains. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you for coming. I hope you had Thank fun. You. Since we have a little bit of, we've got a little bit more time, does anyone have any questions for me? It just doesn't, quit general, doesn't have you about the quiz. I'm happy to answer any questions if you'd like to come up to the mic. We can just chill and hang out for the last little bit. What time is it for you? It is currently 1.47 p.m. I got up at 4 a.m. Oh, rough. <laughs> a little bit, yes. Uh, it is it is uh, very warm and very uh, middle of the day in uh, sunny Australia. Mm-mm-mm. Yes, yes, I can see someone waving. Do you want to ask a question? No, you're just waving. Okay, that's 
that's fair. All right. Well, um, if no one has any other questions, you're free to go. Or we can just hang out here. And I can tell you a little bit about the panels that are on tomorrow. Um, so tomorrow uh, will be uh, the MLC Q&A. So myself plus the two others that I do panels with, uh, sorry, do uh, streaming with. Uh, we'll be talking about our group. We're talking about the games that we play together. Um, we're talking a little bit about ourselves, uh, all that sort of fun stuff. You can ask us some questions. And then uh, it's, that is at 11 a.m. And then at 4 p.m., uh, I'll be going into detail about VTubing. So I'll be showing off the software that I use. I'll show how it all works. I'll be showing you kind of like the ins and outs of it. Um, I'll be demonstrating other software that you can use. I'll be showing off like all like my desk setup, all the hardware that I use, all that fun stuff. So if you'd like to come to that, you can. Um, that will have a lot more free open question time where you can actually ask a lot more about the questions, uh, a lot more about the software, the hardware, all that sort of like more in-depth stuff. Absolutely. Would you like to ask a question? Yes. I'm glad you got your internet fixed. Thank you. Thank you for breaking my internet. <laughs> if you were in the earlier panel, I got asked how my internet is in Australia. And then like right afterwards, the entire thing died. <laughs> so it was good timing, <laughs> but also the worst timing. <laughs> Sorry. But, you know, in the end, it worked out, thankfully. Um, I didn't get to shill uh, how you can come talk to me. Um, at the merch table, uh, at the Anime Fest merch table, because I'll be hanging out there tomorrow when I'm not in my panels. Or you might see me walking around, um, or rather being wheeled around. They've, they, if I'm not here, I'm being shoved into a cage, like, like, um, like what I do to the the people who are naughty in my chat. <laughs> um, and the only way to really truly free me is by coming to my panels and also or buying some of the merchandise. <laughs> And then they will release me at the end of the convention. But until then, I'm trapped here. Sorry. Hello, I have a question. Yes. This is a pretty dumb question, but since, we're in, since you're on Twitch, do you have like a favorite Twitch emote? I do, actually. Um, so currently, <laughs> um, I got a whole bunch of new emotes. Mm -hmm. And I will bring up my favorite one that I use at the moment. Let me find it for you. Thank you. So this is, this is an emote that you can get um, if you use my channel points or if you are a subscriber to my channel. And it is, this one. <laughs> oh, that's cute. I like that one. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> Sounds great. Yeah. Yeah, I have a lot of really good, um, really good emotes. So if you come by my channel, if you give me a follow, you'll get some channel points. It's really cheap. So you can unlock um, mm. lock the emotes and you can use them elsewhere. I have yes. some silly ones like this one. I have like one that's like a, a mimic of the Elmo fire, um, <laughs> which I also quite like. Uh, but I really like the knife savvy one because, you know, it's just, it's just, it's just how I feel sometimes, you know? <laughs> All right. Thank you. No worries. Yes, Venti, would you like to ask a question? All right, so I sort of am a like part-time VTuber, but kind of like oh. struggling with um, mm -hmm. like times and stuff. Do you have any tips and tricks for beginner VTubers? Yes, sure. So um, when, when you start out, one of the really important things is to actually look at what other streamers are doing and kind of see what, what works for them and would work for you. You don't want to copy what they're doing, of course, but um, you want to see, you know, how they interact with the chat. Like I've seen people do some really cool stuff with like chat redeems. Like the, if you have a L2D model, like I do, there's a new thing that came out that's called TITS, which you can throw stuff at the VTuber and it goes like, like they, they react like in real time. Um, and that's like a fun thing. It's like a fun way to make your chat interact. The other thing is you want to make sure that you are, uh, diversifying. So um, I also have a TikTok account. I post a lot of dumb videos on there and that has people coming from TikTok over to my Twitch for when I stream. Um, if you do things like that, um, having a schedule is also really good. So posting online, say, hey, I'm going to be streaming at these times because it's very hard to be discovered on Twitch, especially when you only have like a couple of followers um, or like a, maybe like one or two viewers. It's much harder for other streamers to notice or people that are just looking around on, um, on stream for someone to watch. So that's something else too. 
posting um, when you're going to be streaming, posting it like um, on Twitter. Uh, you can join discords that have like self promo sections that you can post into. That's also very helpful too. Um, another thing is you can also do um, you know, collabing with people. You can find some people to play. Um, like for example, uh, I, I bullied a bunch of my friends into playing Phasmophobia with me, even though they're terrified of horror games. <laughs> Um, or like Among Us is another one. It's fun because you get to interact with more people and you kind of get to see their chats and interact with those people and maybe they'll find that they like your content too. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you so much. No worries. If you come to the panels tomorrow, the VTubing in depth, I can answer some more questions there too, like about the technical stuff. All right. Thank you all for coming. Thanks so much, Belle. Thank you. Bye. Have a good night. Well, um, I didn't expect to run out of questions so quickly. Oh, God. <laughs> Everyone was really fast. I was like, oh, I can't pick too many hard questions because it's kind of mean. And then everyone's like just straight through. And I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> and then, oh, no, when the, when the audio came through, I was just like, oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> just like quickly like adding adding randy going randy 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 mike randy randy mike ah!